On Jordan's stormy banks I stand and cast a wishful lie to gain and spare and happy with where my possessions lie. Keep happening! 
Hello friends, Shannon here, Homestead Rehab at Old Oaks Farm. Hope you're having a great day. Uh, I'm having a pretty good morning, just as you saw, just went and picked up a box of chickens, a box of chicks, the babies from the post, post office this morning. Got another order in from Murray McMurray Hatchery. And uh, this time I ordered some more egg layers, uh, getting my egg layer flock uh, up there where I want it to be. This time around, I've got uh, six, uh, six Rhode Island Reds, I've got six uh, Black Menorcas, and three Americanas. So I've got six brown egg layers, six white egg layers, and three blue egg layers. So I'm going for a varied flock of, uh, of heritage breed chickens. The Menorcas are probably going to become my go-to white egg layers. And uh, uh, I know that Leggerns are probably, uh, and there's some hybrid Leggern types out there that are probably more uh, efficient uh, egg layers. Uh, but I really want to stick with the heritage breeds and uh, the Menorcas. They're a little, a little, uh, how could you say it? They're easier to handle than the Leggerns. They're not as flighty. They're a little bigger, a little bit more calm breed. So I like the Menorcas. Uh, and then the Rhode Island Reds are the, the classic brown egg layer, and I'm looking for lots of brown eggs from them. And then the Americanas, I've never had any of those before, but uh, these will be my first Americanas. Uh, so they're, the, they're sort of the, uh, the go-to uh, blue egg layer in the heritage breed. They are an actual breed. Some people will get Easter Eggers, and they're more of sort of a mutt that uh, they do lay blue eggs and green eggs. So anyway, uh, all of them seem to be doing pretty well, except I've got one that's probably not going to make it. Uh, she does not look like she's doing very well, and she's probably, uh, uh, you know, sometimes you just get chicks that no matter what you do with them, uh, they're just not going to not going to survive failure to thrive or whatever. But uh, I'm not going to spend too much time trying to get her uh, back back to life because it's probably not going to do any good. So, uh, but the rest of them are doing pretty good, and that's that's not bad out of 16 chickens. My math says 15 chickens, but M Murray McMurray, I let them send me a, uh, a bonus chick. And that one is small. It's probably some kind of Bantam. Uh, you know, we'll see what it is. If you enjoy our episodes of Homestead Rehab here at Old Oaks Farm, hit that thumbs up like button, smack that subscribe button, and ring that notification bell. Until next time, I'm the crazy chicken lady. Man. Guy. Dude. Later.